K represents for me the ability to really triumph as an artist and as a woman. Um, she's got exponential impact, so it's not just, oh, here's somebody who wrote great books or wrote a lot of books and went on to some fame. Uh, she represents somebody who came through a time period that it was very difficult for women. The, the obstacles were vastly more challenging than they are now, but we still have them glass ceiling and everything else. So she's somebody that we can look to as an icon of someone who did triumph, did succeed, and, and it's a great personal encouragement. I would love to introduce my daughter to the life of Kay Boyle because she personifies the inner strength of a woman, the inner strength of a human being. Now the fact that she was a woman invited uh, obstacles that wouldn't exist for a man and that that would be interesting for my daughter to know about to see that it doesn't matter what kinds of um, boundaries society presents that if you believe in yourself really and what you have to say and what you have to offer that you can move forward that you can triumph that you can live a fulfilling life and I think Kay did despite all of the setbacks but she needs to be celebrated and honored as someone who women can look to and, and gain strength from and gain inspiration from. She's a hugely inspirational figure who deserves and warrants her story being told. After 28 years, all the more reason. It's one of those great creative acts that somebody just Kelly is, is Kay's the distaff version of Kelly, or vice versa. <laughs> here were two. Here are two people who uh, are infused by a great passion, and Kelly has a serious and thoughtful, invested passion to tell Kelly's to tell. Sorry, to tell Kay's story, and he has not wavered from that journey. And we need to help Kelly realize that journey. He's put in so much of his heart and soul, and it's a, as I say, it's a story that needs to be told, it needs to be heard.